Hey everybody, I wanted to bring you some more Theta information today, considering that Theta is just on an absolute terror, just crushing everybody in its way, all the way up to what, number 17 on the coin market cap. Uh, I wanted to show you a little bit more about how big the uh, edge node for Theta is, all right? And I don't know if a lot of you guys have actually spent time on the Theta's website, but it's thetatoken.org. And what you do is you go up to Docs, you click the docs, and then there's more information. It says documentation. Learn everything you want about the Theta network. And I want to go, go over the Theta Edge Compute, all right? Now, I'm going to read through this. So bear with me, but it's not too long. But I want to bring some light to how big the Theta Edge network is because a lot of people uh, just put it together with uh, Theta is decentralized video, it's video on demand, run off the blockchain, which empowers people like yourself to be able to run a node and gain T-Fuel in response. But it's a lot more than that. And I'm going to bring some light to how big this can get. All right. It says the Theta Edge network can work not only as a data delivery network, but also as a generic edge computing platform. Such a platform allows task initiators to post tasks for edge nodes to download and solve. Task initiators also register the tasks and provide the T-Fuel rewards for each task on the blockchain through smart contracts. Tasks can be anything ranging from solving a set of equations to now get ready for this, finding novel protein structures structures to help fight COVID-19, transcoding a video, to thousands of other applications that can leverage a network of distributed edge computing devices. And we're going to stop right there. I'm sure half of you just went, what? What does Theta have to do with finding novel protein structures to help fight COVID-19? So I'm going to explain this to you. This is how big this is. The Theta Edge Network has taken through the power blockchain the power of many, many, many people's computers and built a network, right? Now, I know you're thinking, yeah, we get it, Ninja. We already know that, and that's how they deliver video. But I want to explain it just a little bit deeper. It's not just video. What it is is that when when computers need to do, we've, we've all heard about quantum computing, right? But most people don't understand what it is. And... The easiest way to explain quantum computing is it's a new way of computing data that was at one point too big for even our biggest mainframe computers, okay? So what is happening is Theta has put together this protocol using blockchain to tie a bunch of computers together worldwide. We're talking, it's gonna be millions of computers worldwide to be able to break down data and decipher it, right? So what happens is, let's say there's a company that wants to uh, get the answer to a complex math equation. And you'd think, why the heck do they want to? Trust me, they want to. Because <laughs> there's, there's a lot of uh, companies out there vying for this, this kind of information. And what they do is they go either, they have two options. They go and buy a massive computer and try and do it themselves. Or they go and rent that computer all right now once again theta has made it possible for companies to not have to pay the high price of buying their own mainframe computer or the high price of renting rack space to uh solve those problems or answer those questions they now can through a smart contract pay the theta network right to do that work for them so this is absolutely massive now i'm going to come down here i'm just going to briefly go over a few of these um, it says right here uh, once a task is solved the edge node can upload the solution to relevant smart contracts on the blockchain right these smart contracts act as a verifier of the solution and now let's go back to the COVID issue right like let's say that a, a government or a company wanted the answer to um, finding n novel protein structures to help fight COVID, right? So, so use that in your mind as an example. It says these smart contracts act as a verifier of the solution and as a trustless escrow for the task rewards. So remember I told you, a company or a government put up, let's say, 
a million dollars to find the solution for COVID and it needs a computer to go out and search the internet and find all these different protein structures that could help fight COVID because they have a specific DNA structure inside of them, right? So they, they put the million dollars into a smart contract on the Theta network and they say, whoever can find us this answer is going to get the reward, right? Well, the Theta network is gonna work together, right? So that smart contract is built. Now it puts the task out for all these edge nodes to use its computing power to go and find this, go and break this, uh, solve this equation, solve this answer, right? Now, then let's say the Theta network now finds an answer. Well, what happens is because it's in a smart contract, now it, uh, it acts as a verifier and now there's that trustless escrow because it's a smart contract and goes, okay, we're ready, we have the answer and we want our reward, right? Once a submitted solution is verified, smart contracts will transfer the reward to the solver, i.e. a particular edge node, automatically and transparently. So everybody knows that the, the, the transaction happened. Now let's say, it says, if a task initiator does not want to reveal the solutions on chain, right, on the blockchain, zero knowledge proof techniques, as in SNARK, can be leveraged. Once an edge node solves a task, it can encrypt the solution using a task initiator's public key and submit the encrypted solution to the smart contracts. This opens up even more possibilities for being able to sell information online. This is absolutely blowing my mind, to be honest with you. Um, this is why Theta will be a multi, multi, multi billion dollar company. And, and quite frankly, once you really get off the, uh, it gets off the rails and running, uh, to see this being a hundred billion dollar uh, uh, blockchain solution is not out of the realm of, of uh possibilities and 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 honestly guys as this uh token this blockchain keeps moving up the 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 top 100 in crypto uh, market caps As a matter of fact let's check out where it is today so as of right now we're sitting at number 17 actually i think that's changed since i started the video um nope still 17. we're at two dollars and 15 cents number 17 as it climbs that ladder the big boys are watching and you know they're watching. They're watching the whole coin market cap period, like the whole top 100 for sure. But as this thing keeps, look at it, it's going to actually overtake EOS soon. <laughs> that's, that's insane. And EOS did a $4 billion offering. And <laughs> Theta did nothing compared to that. And it's about to overtake them. It just goes to show when you have a good pr project with a quality uh, solution at hand and it's a working model, it's just going to crush it. So shoot it might even overtake monero because monero's hitting uh, a pretty big drop right now so anyway guys i'm going to end on that i hope that answered some questions if you haven't checked out the theta web page please do so it's a a wealth of information and again that's going to thetatoken.org and clicking the docs and reading through it so i will leave the link to the actual page here so you can read the entire article or the entire uh, all the information on it and i hope you guys have a great day See you later.